Hello, um, on this tutorial, I will guide you on navigating the users tab. So on the users tab, we have the uh, search form. Here, we can search either the username, email, name, phone number, or even static IPs. For example, we can search the user demo, or um, we can search the mail, let's say, demo mail. An important thing to note is when searching a customer, you can just search the first three or four letters, and you can have all the users with those letters appear. Uh, on the Manage tab here, you can view, recharge, edit, and delete a user. When you click on View here, you can see all the information of the customer for a quick reference. Let's um, go back to the Users tab. Click here on Edit and uh, Edit Balance. For example, let's put 1000. This will add the balance to the user and then click Save Changes. On the Manage column, we can recharge a user directly from the Users tab. So when you click on Recharge, it will uh, direct you to the Activation tab and then activate the user. But for now, the account will be already selected. Fill the other details, then you will click on Recharge. The only difference when clicking on Recharge on the Users tab, instead of Activation, is um, on Users the details for the user will be already auto-filled. You won't have to search for the user again. Let's uh, go back to the Users tab. Now, let's click on Edit under the Manage column. You can edit anything that you want to change and click on Save Changes. Under the Manage column, when you click on Delete, it will delete the customer from your dashboard and database. So, these options um, Active users, expired users, hotspot users, and so on are currently not working, but they will be updated in the next updates. Under the column package, if the package or plan name is in green, like this, that means the customer has an active package. And if the package is in red, it means the account is expired. Finally, if the package is just a red full stop, it means the customer has never used a package or bought a package. The option here for CSV, when you click on it, um, it will download users into a CSV file. That is it for this page. That is it, and thank you for watching.